Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, as a follow up to my how to learn a driver manual transmission in under five minutes video, we're gonna talk about the five things you should try to never do while driving a manual transmission. Now the suggestions that I'm about to pose in this video aren't the end of the world if you don't follow them to a T, but they'll help dramatically extend the life of your transmission and your clutch. And they can also provide for a much smoother driving experience as well. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. And in case you're wondering, the demonstration vehicle for today's video is my 2017 BMW 340i, and it has a six speed manual transmission. Okay, so to kick the video off, let's go ahead and start the car up. Foot on the clutch pedal, press the start button. Okay, so the first thing you never wanna do in a manual transmission is sit at a stoplight in first gear with your foot on the clutch. And I'll go ahead and demonstrate what you don't wanna do here. Okay, so we're moving and I see a stop sign ahead. Put my foot on the clutch and the brake. And as I come to a stop, I'm putting the car in neutral and take my foot off the clutch completely. What you don't wanna do is sit at the stoplight with your foot and brake on the clutch because this can cause unnecessary wear on the clutch and the transmission. Therefore, like I said, just pop it in neutral and have your foot on the brake only. Okay, so the second thing you never wanna do in a manual transmission is rest your hand on the shift knob here while you're driving or in gear. If you do that, you may put inadvertent pressure on different areas of the shifter here, and that can cause unnecessary wear on the shifter fork and the shift lever. Okay, so the third thing you never wanna do in a manual transmission is shift gears until the clutch pedal is completely depressed to the floor. Now, if I go ahead and demonstrate that, we're gonna get moving. Starting to drive here. If I shift in the second gear, my foot is completely to the floor and therefore I can shift. If you only press the clutch pedal in a little bit to shift, you might not engage the clutch fully and cause unnecessary wear on the transmission and the clutch plate. Okay, so the fourth thing you never wanna do in a manual transmission is bog the engine down in a high gear when you're trying to accelerate. Okay, so what I mean by that is say you're cruising at 40 miles an hour, but you're in fifth gear at a low RPM. What you don't want to do is just try to stab the gas to try and pass someone. You want to try and downshift as much as possible to raise the RPM so you don't cause internal wear on the engine. Okay, so the fifth thing you never want to do in a manual transmission is only leave the car in neutral when you're trying to park. So when you're done driving, come to a stop, put it in first gear, pull the handbrake, and then turn the engine off. This provides an extra layer of security in case of a steep hill or if the handbrake fails. Another quick tip that I wanted to mention here is that you always wanna try and slow down in a respective gear rather than just putting it in neutral. Putting the transmission in neutral here and just coming to a stop using the brake can cut off various fluid supply to the transmission components and can wear them out quickly over time. So demonstrating that here, I'm moving. If I wanna to come to a stop, I'm off the gas completely, still in first gear, use the brake, put the clutch in, still in first gear until I come to a complete stop, and now I can put it in neutral. So that about does it for the five things you should try to not do when you're driving a manual transmission. Like I said, if you don't do these things or follow them to a T, it won't be the end of the world, but it will dramatically increase the life of your transmission and your clutch. I wanted to make this a quick video for you guys. Hopefully it was easy to follow. Please be sure to leave any questions in the comments section. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe. I want to thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.